Hey guys, this week in the rundown, the Navy's child care program has extended its hours. We're looking at the Bay of Conference that just took place in Philadelphia, and the Olmsted Scholars Program is accepting applications for those interested in foreign language. Child care programs throughout the DOD are scheduled to be increased to 14 hours a day. The hours have been extended to better accommodate work and educational schedules, time spent for physical fitness, deployment schedules, and other family needs. Starting in April 2016, we're beginning a phased rollout to increase the hours of our child development centers by one hour in the morning and one hour in the evening. Currently, hours are from 6 a.m. to 6 p.m., but as the plan goes into effect, new hours will be from 5 a.m. to 7 p.m., which will match the opening and closing times in our before, after school, and summer day camp programs offered at our youth centers. Our plan is to have these extended hours available to all our installations by early 2017. For more about the change, you can read the story on Navy Live or you can visit www.militarychildcare.com. This past weekend, CMP attended the Black Engineer of the Year Award, or Bay of Conference in Philadelphia. The annual STEM conference, STEM for Science, Technology, Engineering, and Math, brings together students from around the country to train and network with employees, service members, and professionals in their prospective fields. Each year, service members from each branch are recognized for their academic achievements and contributions as leaders and mentors within the STEM community. Our very own MPTE Fleet Master Chief Beldo was recognized as the Senior Enlisted Award winner. For more information on BEA or to see the list of winners, you can visit www.bea.org. Finally, if you're interested in foreign language, applications are being accepted for the Fiscal Year 18 Omsky Scholars Program. The program gives officers the chance to receive two years of graduate studies of a foreign language at a foreign university. In addition, those selected will be provided cultural and overseas travel opportunities. Twelve sailors will be selected for the program in March 2017 and are expected to complete their study in 2020. Applicants must turn in their package with a command endorsement and detail their statement no later than August 26. So be sure to get those in. To read all the details and to see if you're eligible, Check out NAVADMIN 034-16 on NPC's webpage. Well, that's all for this week. For any questions, send us a message at usnpeople at gmail.com. For the Chief of Naval Personnel, I'm MC2 LJ Burleson. Thanks for watching. <laughs>